In this video, we will be studying about the other modes of nutrition in plant. So the, the first one we will be studying about in this video is heterotrophic nutrition. The next video we will uh, we'll be studying about the other mode that is your saprotrophs, right? Now heterotrophic nutri uh, nutrition, you all know that the plant, there are certain plants which are not green and there are animal soup. Too. So the animals and non-green plants such as fungi and bacteria cannot prepare their own food. They depend directly on or indirectly on the green plants for their nutrition. Now this mode of nutrition is called heterotrophic nutrition. See when your animals and the plants depend upon the other plants for their food then that uh, mode of nutrition is known as heterotrophic nutrition animals and non-green plants because green plants can prepare their food whereas non-green plants such as fungi and bacteria cannot prepare their own food Now they directly or indirectly depends on green plants for their nutrition. Now this mode of nutrition is known as heterotrophic nutrition and these animals in non-green plants are known as heterotrophs these animals and non-green plants are called heterotrophs. These depends on the green plants for their mode of nutrition. Now when you eat meat, you are direct, indirectly depending on food prepared by plants. Now you know that green plants get the energy to prepare food from the sun. The sun is the ultimate source of energy for all the living organisms. Now if I talk about the heterotrophic nutrition in plant, this was the heterotrophic nutrition about the animals and the non-green plants. Now let's discuss about heterotrophic nutrition in plants. Now heterotrophic nutrition in plants. See some non-green plants live in or on other living organism. and derive their food from them. Now these plants are called parasites. They do not prepare their own food, they depend on the other plants for the food. Now the plant from which a parasite gets its food is known as the host plant. The plant from which parasite gets its food is called host plant. 
Now some parasitic plants like a uh, mistly toy plant, mistly toy plant, which grows on the trees such as mangoes. Now this is the host plant and the this is the parasite. Now they take water and minerals from the host plants. They are known as partial parasites. Now there are some plants, those who have the green leaves and can synthesize their food. But they take the water and minerals from the host plants, from the roots of the host plant. They do not uh, take the water and minerals from their own roots. Now these are known as the partial parasites. Uh, the plants that have green leaves and can synthesize their food but take water and mineral from the host plants are known as partial parasites. There are some plants known as insectivores plants. Now these plants do not prepare their own food whereas these plants consume insects. These plants consumes insects to get their nutrition. Now for example, the Venus flytrap, this is a plant and pitcher plant. Now, what happens, this pitcher plant has a leaf, let's say this is the uh, leaf of the pitcher plant, it is this kind of leaf they have, pitcher plants, and they have a little lid over it. Now, whenever, and the, this is connected to the leaves, now this is a plant, this is a leaf. Of the plant now this part is connected at the end of the leaf of the plant now whenever any insect come inside this structure the lid gets closes now this structure has a small hair pointed downwards now the whenever the insects enters in this pitcher plant the lid closes to trap the insect and it gets entangled in these hairs it has. Now the cells of the pitcher plant secrete some digestive juices to digest the insect. Now digestive juices are secreted by plants to digest the insect. Now these plants can uh, grow in the soil which is not rich in nutrients. As these plants get the nutrients from the insects itself. Now they use the nutrition obtained from insects to, su to supplement the food they prepare by photosynthesis. Right. So these are the types of plants you can talk about. These are the heterotrophic nutrition modes. Do download our scholars learning app and enjoy the learning experience with us.